What is going on YouTube? Welcome to another tutorial. Let's take a look at creating minimalist art from an existing picture. First thing you want to do is open a new page, set it to whatever dimensions you want. We're going to leave the background white for now. Now go and get your picture, a superhero or whatever. Me, I have a nice little picture of Lady Liberty from the internet here. Copy it and paste it on top of your background. This will show as a new layer. Reposition it as you wish. Once you have your picture in place, open your zoom tool by pressing Z and zoom in a couple of times. Now select the pen tool by pressing P. Click on any point and then click and hold on another point and move your mouse until you get a curve that perfectly fits your object. Now hold Alt on Windows or Option on OS X and click on the point in the middle. One of the extreme points will disappear. Now repeat and go around your entire object. If you're just starting out on Photoshop, this can be a little tricky, so obviously don't start with the Statue of Liberty or something complex like that. When you're done, click on the first point again. Observe that a circle will now appear next to your cursor. Now zoom out. Pressing Alt or Option alongside left click with the zoom tool selected will zoom you out. Go back to the pen tool and right click on your object. Click on Make Selection and hit OK. See that your object is now selected. Press Ctrl plus J or Command plus J to create a new layer which contains only your object. Now delete the layer just beneath and you'll end up with just your object. You can make refinements at this point. You're perfectly fine to select two loops at once by the way. Again, make selection, click on your layer, and just hit the delete. Now click on your background layer and color it to whichever shade you wish. I have a nice Lady Liberty Green already picked out, so I'm going to use that. If this is your first time doing this, this will blow your mind. Right click on your layer and hit blending options. Now you want either color overlay or gradient overlay. Turn on color overlay, maybe set it to black. If you want gradient, make it go from green to black or something like that. The rest is entirely your choice. Add text, play around with the overlays, whatever you want. Now the font that I use for my minimalist art is Helvetica New. Download link is in the description. Thanks for watching. Check out my gaming videos by clicking the links right here on this page. And make sure you like and subscribe.